What's up guys? Welcome back to the Junk Food Zombie channel. I got a quick video for you today. I picked up a, uh, a rifle recently and uh, it's 1981, 1982, so it's 30, 32 year old rifle, 33 year old rifle and uh, it was used as a hunting gun but it was in really good shape. It's a Marlin and it was a Marlin before Marlin was owned by the Freedom Group which owns Remington and Bushmaster. Um, there's no cross bolt safety. It's, it's an older Marlin and they're kind of the ones that I like. And it was in really nice shape. It just had a few little spots where there was some minor rust on it. And I want to show you how if you find a gun that you like and, and it's in good shape but it's got a little bit of surface rust, that you can take care of it. If it's, if it's minor, it's real easy to take care of. So this is what we're going to do. All you're going to need is a couple things. Just a little bit of oil. Any, any, any gun oil will do. I use this because it's cheap and, and you're not using it to lubricate anything anyway except for the steel wool. You'll want 4 aught steel wool and it'll come in a package like this, 4 aught, 4 zeros, it's fine. You'll find this anywhere where they sell painting supplies. You can get it in, in Walmart, I think I got this in Walmart, in the painting department. Um, but it has to be 4 aught, you don't want to use the heavier coarse stuff or you can damage the finish if you, if you go on it too hard. So 4 aught steel wool and a little oil is all you'll need. Now if you see right here under the barrel, there's, there's a few spots, but I'll give you this as an example. There's a little bit of rust there. Minor, but it's surface rust on the bluing. Now you want to be able to get rid of this rust without getting rid of the bluing. And depending on how bad the rust is, you can, it might, it might go through the bluing and you might have to retouch it up with some bluing, but you can get a lot of the surface rust off without hurting the bluing. All you'll do is you'll take a little oil, Put it on the gun where the rust is, take the steel wool and just gently work the steel wool over where the rust is. You're not going to really hurt anything with the oil. If you got wood, you don't want to soak it down. Just get a light coating of oil is all you need. Got a little bit of rust here and uh, I think that's, that's about it. Do that. Make sure you get it. You can you can push pretty firmly. You're not going to hurt the bluing with this 4 aught steel wool very easily. You're, you really have to work hard to do any damage to the finish. So take that off. Wipe that oil away. And you see that all that rust is gone. There's nothing left. It's completely gone. Now I had a couple spots on the rifle. Such as here. You'll see in the front here. Where the rust was a little a little more serious. I don't know if you can see it or not, but there's a couple light speckles. The rust did go through the bluing. It didn't really damage the metal, but it did remove the bluing um, when it rusted. But there's no rust there anymore, so all you'll do is take a little bluing and patch that up. Uh, there was quite a bit of, quite a few spots like this one on this rifle when I had picked it up. But most of them are completely gone, and it's very easy to take care of. I had some under the barrel here. You'd never know it was there. It's all gone. As it was right up over here, actually. There's a little bit of it left, but it was pretty pretty blatant. And now you can't hardly see it at all. And that's all you got to do. You take a rifle and you'll, you'll touch it up with a little steel wool, and that'll get rid of uh, most of those, those minor imperfections. And then you'd uh, never know they were there. And that's all. Okay, so that's all there is to it. It's real simple. It's cheap to do. A couple bucks for steel wool, a couple bucks for oil, probably five bucks or less and you get this done. And uh, it'll take an older rifle like this and it'll get it into to really nice shape. As long as you don't have any major rusting or pitting where you need to do sanding and real refinishing, uh, it's a real easy job. It's real quick. Um, and I'll, I'll make another video and show you how to touch up that bluing a little bit. That's pretty simple as well. Okay guys, I hope that helped you out. It's really simple. Um, it's something that I, I learned and it was eye-opening. It was wonderful to know that a little bit of surface rust can be removed really easily. And I uh, hope you liked the video. If you did, click on the like button and uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. I've got some more stuff. I'm going to do a little thing on bluing as well. And uh, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope that it helped you out. And if you have any comments, leave them below. Any, any advice, anything you know, or, or whatever you want to put down there, feel free. And we'll see you next time. Thanks.